the bone. That's good. Your power is really good, Nathaniel. Just try to get more consistency on that. This is the India Cultural Center's Table Tennis Center in California's Silicon Valley. It's the largest of its kind in North America, drawing children as young as five to learn this fast-paced sport. Whenever we get those kids, five years or six years, they, know, they don't know anything about table tennis. So what we do with them is we try to teach them table tennis, but at the same time we introduce a lot of fun games with them. One, two, one, two, four. The new facility, which has custom lighting and a special table tennis floor, was funded in part by parents, many of them immigrants who work in the area's technology fields. The, these kids, uh, they are born and brought up here, but their parents uh, belong to the countries where table tennis is popular, so parents are interested, they bring their kids here to learn table tennis. For years, serious American table tennis players had to travel to Stockholm, Moscow, or Beijing to train with world-class coaches. No more, says Rajul Sheth, the center's executive director and a former member of the Indian national table tennis team. So parents used to send them to other countries, but now from last year, what we started at ICC here, we started getting all the top players and coaches from other cross. countries to here. Cross, cross, oh, cross. yeah, cross, you want to cross. Far from being an afternoon pastime, table tennis here is serious business. I like it and I don't know why, but it's fun. They start enjoying the game. We go more and more technically with them and uh, I think in two or three years, they are in a professional circuit. Now many of the country's best young players train here, including the center's star, a 14-year-old Dynamo. My name is Ariel Shane and I am number one under 22 women for the U.S. in table tennis. Ariel practices forehands, backhands, and her quick footwork at the table tennis center, where her skills are well known. She trains like seven days a week. She trains a lot, and she's been playing longer, more experience. At home, she returns lobs from her father Michael in a custom-built addition to their San Jose home. Yeah, not like a full-time job, <laughs> six times a week, three hours minimum a day. Mm -hmm. So it's pretty tough for her and us. <laughs> And her commitment has paid off. So those are my medals. This one was my first Pan America um, Junior Championships in Canada. And I won it when I was 12 years old. A prodigy who began playing at the age of seven. Ariel has even shown a couple of amateurs a thing or two. It was um, Mr. Warren Buffett's 75th birthday party. I was invited by a friend of Mr. Warren Buffett as like a gift, you know, a table tennis lesson. They're, they were surprisingly good, actually, yeah. Now she's training hard for a spot on the Junior Olympic squad, but she's already looking forward to the future. Yeah, I hope that I will be able to make it to the 2012 Olympics and then hopefully like medal in the 2016. That would be really great.